Welcome back. We're on the tailgate. Got it. Another video. Welcome back to another video. Uh, follow up to my STI Dawson Precision optics plate. As promised, I did get the Trigicone RMR right here. This is a RMR 06. <clears throat> so it is the three and a half MOA Red Dot Type 2 RMR. I run the 06s. Mr. Boondock Wraith suggested the 06. He is one of my loyal companions. Um, not in a weird gay way or anything like that, but one of my gun guys, he recommended that when I was getting into the optics world on a pistol. And this is pretty much all I've run. That seems to work. I like Trigicons. So, uh, that's what it is. You can see it does have the little star pattern down there. Uh, that is different. Gives you multiple contacts on the battery. So you don't have a little flutter that the Type 1's suffered from. A couple things come with it. Get some screws, <clears throat> a battery, some stickers, and some uh, different material as far as reading is concerned. It does come in the nice Trigicon hard case, almost not a pelican, but it's almost like a little pelican. These are very cool, a little robust, kind of neat. Uh, Overkill for such a tiny little thing? Eh, potentially, but I don't have a problem with it. So, anyways, this guy is going to go on here. If you didn't catch my last video, or the video before that, whatever. My last video on this pistol. <clears throat> this is a Dawson Precision uh, optic plate for the Staccato. I believe they're universal as far as the Staccatos are concerned, and these plates... I don't think this is a P-series plate. I think it is just the Dawson Precision plate. So I'm thinking all the Staccato STI models all come with this. The Duo model, I should say, all come with the same plate and the same rear sight. So that's what that is. We're going to start uh, installing this. I do have some Loctite here. Um, we'll do that and get that on there. It does look like these screws have some Loctite on there already. Get that bolted on, take you guys along the way, and we'll go from there. <gasps> breaking news, ladies and gentlemen, breaking news. Let's see if we can get that to focus. This guy here. Uh, where are we? Yeah, there we are. That guy here came out of the RMR box. Got some precision screw. The RMR does not fit. You need to use the Dawson Precision hardware <coughs> to mount it here. Goodness, it is hard to see today, guys. Sorry. Let's see if I can brighten this thing up for you a little bit here so basically the screws that came in the Trigicon will thread in here but they bought them out long before the RMR is actually tight so you will have to use the Dawson precision screws which are a quarter of the way shorter I would say than the RMR screws that come with it in the box so, we're going to go, oh my gosh, CP16 is so amazing. I'm not sure how I feel about this Dawson Precision kit here. If you haven't seen the video, go back and watch it. 
I'm fiending to make a living off of YouTube someday, and I need your views, likes, and subscribes. Anyway, um, <clears throat> this is the kit. It is not compatible with the Trigicon screws. They are smaller. The Trigicon comes with this little 12-point uh, star bit, Torx bit. And the Dawson Precision just comes with a smaller Allen head. Better? I don't know. Worse? I don't know. Different? Absolutely. So, that is a look at it though. And all this staccato 2011 goodness. Where is that? Oh, there's the dot is. It's on. It's working. Uh, I'm gonna put some Loctite on there, some 243 Loctite. It's probably the wrong one, so all you gun nuts uh, can crucify me later if you want, after you like and subscribe. It's the Loctite that I had, so it's the Loctite that I used. It's not the red stuff, so it could come off eventually. <clears throat> that is a look, guys. Rack, rack, bang, bang, pop, pop. Thank you for tuning in. It is an update. We will get this sighted in probably in the next couple of days, more than likely. And we will go from there. But I just used my high end Wheeler little uh, gunsmithing set here. Torqued it on with my Soldier Boy uh, tight. And that's that. So. Look at the RMR. So, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, like and subscribe if you want to. As always, if you don't, don't. Those 102 of you that are subscribers, I do appreciate it. And, yeah. We will catch you back out on the tailgate, the range, the trail, uh, wherever. Bye-bye.